Ooh. Just got a haircut, my boys, but y'all, I did something today. Let it, let it, let it read this. I did something today, y'all. Getting a new camera to use to vlog. I'm honestly so excited because I love this one and it's a good camera, but it's just too big, like. It's just too big and especially if I want to start recording more like outside I don't want to be using this camera the whole time especially like with this lens Yeah, I'll show y'all what I get and let's go. Let's go get ready Yeah, I've really been wanting pizza and I'm so tempted to go to Papa John's. But I'm not. I'm not. What's up guys? So I finally went and bought the camera. I want to show y'all what I bought. Um, when I first started my YouTube channel, I was pretty sure that I wanted a camera to start with instead of just starting with my phone, even though there's literally like nothing wrong with starting with your phone. But I just wanted to get a camera that I could do both YouTube with and also photography. So I ended up going with the Canon EOS RP and that's what I've been using to record. And I still use my phone here and there because it's a lot smaller than this camera. So that's the reason I bought this. I got the Canon G7X Mark III and I literally got it for a still. This camera runs about $700. She sold it to me for $450. And she was literally like, I know this is a still, like, be glad that you hopped on this right away. Because I was going through, I was just on Facebook and I was looking for a camera a while back. So it always recommends me cameras. This one popped up and it was like $500, but I want to get rid of it because I've had it for so long and I don't use it. And I looked at her profile. She seemed like pretty legit because sometimes I don't be trusting those. She seemed pretty legit and so she had like a history of a bunch of stuff she sold so I hit her up and I was like hey like I want this camera is anything wrong with it and are you set on the price and she was like honestly I'm trying to get rid of it if you buy it today I will sell it to you for 450 and I said girl I am on my way and yeah so I wanted to open it with y'all oh should I be should I record it like this Let's act like I didn't get it. Let's act like I didn't get it. Let me take y'all into some B-roll while I open this up. <laughs> we in this bitch. This ain't gonna be the first time that I do numbers on two crutches. Seen more plaques than two brushes. Until I'm at the pearly white gates, I gotta move something, do something. All meetings happen in person so they can't prove nothing. Known her eight years and still fuck her like a new husband. Trying to run a country like Putin one day, but who's rushing? Who's bluffing? For real. Who you hugging? Who you want to be loving? I play 48 minutes on a tour meniscus. Who's subbing? El Chico Luxury. Want to see my niggas ball so bad I started up a league. Fuck with me. You niggas can't trouble me from the double tree. Step your sweets up. I get Oliver to set the beats up. 2021, I had to wet the streets up. All right, y'all. So this is me on my EOS RP. And now I'm going to switch to this one. So let's... But yeah guys, this is me now on my new Canon G7X compared to my RP. Honestly, I, I really do like this camera and I almost thought about selling it, which I'm so glad I didn't now and I don't think I will. Who knows, I might change my mind. But this one, as you can tell, is just so big like for vlogging or daily use compared to this one. So I feel like, especially at that price, it was a necessary purchase. But I'm honestly 
super super excited to be using this camera and yeah but yeah no i want to test it with this all right y'all now this is the canon with the external microphone the dead mouse dead cat i think it's called dead cat but yeah, I really think that I'm gonna like this camera a lot and I'm honestly like super excited to use it. But yeah, I just wanted to share this moment with y'all, so. Y'all, one thing I hate about myself. Okay, I won't say hate, cause I feel like hate is like a really strong word. But one thing I really, really dislike is that I be overthinking things so much to the point where like I just don't record because I feel like I don't know how to even start recording and I think I'm just too worried about just having like the perfect video instead of just filming so yeah just just thought I'd tell y'all patience ain't no virtue with you I don't waste plenty time pacing around hate this cool you with bitches on the side and let my mind wander too you relentless nigga, I don't need brand new nigga Talk to me like I'm waiting for you to come lie to me Oh my day saying just hurt me, I can't compete Still on the way, I lay away, give you not around me I'm so on you, still gon' feel Eating you, talk to me, in your love language Show me, yeah, how to connect What's up guys, so... Oh shit, I took the wrong way. So, I've been using this camera for about a week now and I kind of wanted to take it out. I need to go shopping anyways for a trip that's coming up. So I wanted to just um, take it with me to just show y'all how well it works and just to use it for myself as well. And to just take this time to talk to y'all about, you know, just about some things. <laughs> so I just wanted to take the time to talk to y'all just about the other day. So I made a comment saying that I was struggling because I was just overthinking things and like I was trying to be like too perfect with ideas to come up with and like different topics to talk about and content to create. But honestly, I was watching this YouTuber named Lynette Atkins. She is a YouTuber that I've honestly watched for a while now, before she had like hundreds of thousands of subscribers. So, you know, I was the OG, the OG. I was, check the receipts, check the comments, check the likes. Um, no, but I was just listening to one of her videos. She was talking about how like when it comes to making videos and posting on YouTube You pretty much have to do it because if you just keep overthinking it Then but obviously like that's not gonna get you anywhere because you're gonna be thinking about what to do so much that you never do anything and so I really felt like she was talking to me because that's something that I've been struggling with and even I even like brought it up the other day. So I feel like I really do just need to start recording and just, I mean, obviously like plan stuff, but don't overthink it because I feel like most of the time, even when I do overthink it and I do record, I still end up getting good footage. And um, also I started watching my old videos again, just because you know, I was just curious and like I was bored, so I was just watching them. And I feel like it was honestly something that I needed to do because I realized even though I was like 
camera shy and somewhat even though I was camera shy in some of the videos I still feel like I was being you know myself and that was honestly like pretty refreshing to see I feel like it kind of just gave me the motivation that I needed because I feel like it just gave me the motivation that I needed and kind of like that kickstart that I've been needing and been looking for because I was still just you know like I was still like a little shy and holding back which I feel like I'm still just getting comfortable with the camera y'all really like enjoyed that content and there was parts in there that I was even like debating on posting and there's even like other parts that I remember I cut out which I regret doing I was just nervous to post some of those parts and I feel like the parts that I wanted to take out were the parts that people like would comment about or like the most so it just proved that I was just in my head too much about things and I just need to do it I just need to do it like sometimes I think I'm being too boring or sometimes I'm not giving enough energy but at the end of the day like I don't want to fake who I am or like get on camera and just fake like hey guys blah 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 blah, blah because that's just not me I'm like more chill like more laid back and I do have moments where I'm super energetic and happy and like just excited most of the time it's just me like lay back just chill yeah I just want to come on here and just thank you guys again you know for rocking with me and you know even though I did leave for a year because of deployment like coming back and just seeing so much love and comments and stuff like that it it really just helps me feel motivated To Georgia, back to Atlanta. Money, I'm present to the past. I'm a fly Priscilla, I'll just.